Hi, I'm DJ Ali, journalist. Uh, welcome to Sodok Park. Inside the park, I noticed that there's uh, a primary school inside the park, in Sodok Park, um, sorry, kids. It's called Rhoda High Primary School. I'm sure I'm not allowed to film it, so I'm not going to film it at all. So, and also, I have to be discreet about how I film here because this is my first time in the park, so I don't know what the park is all about. Um, well, I think Sodok Park is situated in in between Sorry Case and Bermondsey. So Jamaica Road is on the other side, and uh, Sorry Case is uh, behind me here. I'm actually walking from Sodok Park, so uh, you can say I actually enter Sodok Park through Sorry Case. So it's my first time here, like I said before. It's lovely, it's nice. I'm gonna see if they've got nice toilets too. But I've just found out that there's a primary school inside the park. And also, um, there are children in the park playing. You know, I think it's PE time, you know. So I'm sure I'm not allowed to film it, so I'm not going to film it, you know. There are lots of law, you know, protecting the children out there, so I have to be careful of what I do so that they don't say I'm a pedophile. You have to be, you know, very careful about that. Um, just after the first, I, know, I don't know if you can say, there's a man just, you know, trimming his garden. You know, people love garden, and coming behind me, somebody's actually running, so that's what people do in the park. The exercise, uh, push the pram, like I said, you can hear the best singing, or probably telling me, Oi, I love your phone, can I have it, or you, can you get me one, you understand, so, and also I can see another senior art school, seniors art school, just there, that is it, just there, let me just point at it, if you can see it. My finger, I'm just covering it. So, senior art school. Uh, so, yeah, that's that. So, let me just pause and then see what I can do again. Show you here. Okay, welcome back. I just have to whisper this down because I actually saw I saw a boy and a girl on the bench. I don't know if you can see them behind me. Um, no, no, I don't think so. Um, that's what Park is known, uh, known for. You know, people come here, lovers, they come here, sit down, eat, talk, kiss, snog, do whatever, lie down, have a good time, have lunch together. Yeah, that's what Park is all about. But, um, I was actually suspicious about this couple because I reckon it's an allegation, so I'm not 100% sure, but I suspected that they were building spliff, they were spliffers, trying to smoke ganja. So ladies and gentlemen, smoking and drinking is not permitted, but as soon as they saw me, you know, I just had to hide my camera because the guy looked very, very, very aggressive. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you can see behind me, we have a lovely pond there. And you can see lots of ponds, you know, swimming, having a good time. And obviously they, they have other birds there, you know, just sharing the pond with them. Uh, God knows what's there as well, but I cannot go too close because there's a barrier behind me so I have to make sure that I stay away from Femi and their children on the other side too. Well, perhaps you can see the pond very clearly. It's such a lovely pond. I love it. And it's so clean. Surprise, surprise. And uh, you can see the dogs there singing and praising probably to God or if they don't worship the God, they must be praising someone. 
So it's such a nice place, you know. And I'm wondering where in Lagos, I live in Lagos, so I don't know about any other states in Nigeria. So, but if you live outside Lagos, where in Lagos or in any part of Nigerian states that we have ponds like this in the park that people can go and we have wildlife, you know. Uh, it's only dog. Look at this dog coming to me. It's not even afraid of me. You know, animals in this country, they're so friendly. They think we are friends. They're not scared at all. He or she is probably thinking that, you know, I've got food for them, but Alabama. I hope you understand um, austerity, you know, it's austerity, you know. So, yeah, it would be nice to go to places like this in Lagos or in any part of Nigerian states, you know, where you'll be able to look at the wildlife, feed them, touch them, play with them. Or probably dance shocky with them if you are a big fan of shocky dancing, you know, or shakti bobo, you know, kind of thing, you know. But it's a lovely place, I love it so far. And I, I hope you can see the building behind me. At least 1,000 Londoners who are watching this video will live in this building. It's quite. Uh, a high story building. I'm guessing it might be, ooh, I don't know, probably 15 story. It's long and it's nice and it's next to Soda Park. Park. Park is known as a place where people can come and read. And I don't know if you can see the background properly. There's a gentleman there reading a novel. That's what people do in the park as well. More to come. Isn't it wonderful that we have flowers, lots of flowers here. This place is called Garden. Um, I don't want to upset God, but this could be Garden of Eden. You know, so it's a lovely place. I love it. You know, but you know, it happened that I'm the only one here in the garden. I should have come with a, um, a date, probably a rental model or escort to come with me so that we can enjoy the romantic filming together. But I have to say, I must be very, very careful because, uh, you know, these are about. And I'm actually holding uh, one of the expensive Samsung mobile phone HD recording. So I think I have to go now. I'm very scared because I'm the only one in this part of the garden. And the reason is, it's not lunchtime yet. Everybody's in the office and the school children, they're in schools.